This is the oldest Teoju temple, right? The building structure is dated back to 1895. It's actually rare that we have such relatively intact building for hundreds of years. And that's why I think that it's particularly important that uh, we study and try to restore it. Prior to this, I have never really worked on a full-scale restoration project. In order for us uh, to start even restoring the temple, we need to understand the history. Because uh, this particular building, there's no stone carvings that tell you of who founded the building, uh, when it was constructed, uh, and all this historical information. When we completed the restoration project, I decided that we need to go further back into time to find out the origins of this particular building. After 10 years of work, it resulted in the book. I think the main takeaway uh, for the book is really about the early history of Singapore, more specifically about this particular group of uh, Singaporeans, which are the Teochews. So once I have sufficient materials to write a manuscript, I decided that uh, we need to look for a publisher to think about publishing and producing a book. And certainly with a book of this nature where I would like to include a lot of colour plates, colour photographs, the publishing cost will be quite uh, enormous, which is why I think uh, the National Heritage Board grant is actually very useful to make our history more accessible to more people.